We are learning new details tonight about the two men arrested and charged in connection with the shooting of two Indiana judges. Yeah, police took Brandon Kaiser and Alfredo Vasquez into custody after an hours long SWAT standoff on the city's east side. News 8's Julia Deng was the only reporter at the scene over the weekend. She's here now with what she's learned from the charging documents. Julia? Yeah, Mike, I watched on Saturday as negotiators tried to get Kaiser to come out of his home. It took them nearly four hours, and now he's charged with shooting both judges from Clark County. They got him surrounded over in his house over here. Sean Shelton watched with more than a dozen neighbors as detectives, medics, fire officials, and a SWAT team lined the 2100 block of Wallace Avenue near 21st and Emerson. They posted up all the way down, all the way down the street. They pleaded with the man barricaded in his home. He ignored them. Neighbors watching the standoff brought their dinner outside for a stand up picnic. Now we got chicken and everything else going on. They didn't get much of a show. Police say it ended peacefully. 41 year old Brandon Kaiser walked out and was taken into custody. Detectives found his accused getaway driver and next door neighbor. 23 year old Alfredo Vasquez, two miles away. It's not a bad neighborhood, it's just. Vasquez and Kaiser are charged in connection with the shootings of Andrew Adams and Bradley Jacobs. Both are Clark County judges. They were shot last week in the parking lot of a downtown White Castle. We're pretty sure that this had nothing to do with the. The profession. Charging documents state Vasquez and Kaiser were kicked out of Kilroy's about an hour before they pulled up at the fast food joint in a dark blue SUV. Can't be too much safety if two judges were shot. Detectives identified them using this footage, video from the bar, and a bar tab Vasquez paid with his credit card. He admitted to going to White Castle with Kaiser and getting into a fight with two men he claims he didn't know. After Vasquez stopped punching them, detectives say video shows Kaiser shooting Judge Adams in the stomach and Judge Jacobs twice in the chest. Kaiser is charged with attempted murder, battery, and carrying a handgun without a license. Vasquez is charged with assisting a criminal. We're ecstatic that the the suspects have been arrested and they're now in custody and they'll face their day in court. Brandon Kaiser and Alfredo Vasquez are due in court tomorrow morning. They are in custody at the moment at the Marion County Jail. Meanwhile, an attorney for the two judges says they are recovering at Eskenazi and IU Health and will eventually be back on the bench. Live in the studio, Julia Dang, Wish TV, News 8.